the Russian missile-based onslaught of the Ukrainian civilian infrastructure has been ongoing for some time now, and despite many believing that Russia would soon run out of missiles, they have continued to attack. However, recent information tells us that things may be changing for the good. On the ground evidence shows that at least one of the recently fired KH-101 cruise missiles was produced towards the end of this year. Several other missile types used were also produced in 2022. This doesn't mean that the Russian stock has been exhausted, but it does mean that it has started using missiles directly from the factory. What this also means is that despite the sanctions, they are still making cruise missiles, but finding it more difficult to do so. It is estimated that the missiles available in Russia allow for only one or two more massive attacks. Either that, or the time between attacks is going to increase substantially. The rate that Ukraine is destroying these missiles is also starting to make this aerial assault extremely expensive for Russia. Only time will tell.